Mary Kay is here now with the check of the forecast, and we see it still laying out along the shoreline, but it's tapered off throughout the day. Yes, in Illinois side, we're okay, but over in Indiana, that's been the focus for this lake enhancement. Some of our weather watchers really having a deal with it. 21 degrees right now from Larry in Valparaiso, and he tells us that he has heavy snowfall currently. And in fact, we also have a 22 degree reading, a little closer there from Greg in Porter. Now, Porter has been an area hard hit with this afternoon snow. Here's a look from Chesterton. And in fact, some of the roads are actually closed in the area. We're a hard time getting around because near zero visibility with some of these lake enhanced snow bands. Now, they are forecast to continue as we move through the evening, and it's mostly for Porter and LaPorte counties. The Illinois side is clearing out. We will have rising temperatures the next few days and go into the 40s by the time the weekend rolls around. 22 degrees is our current temperature. Winds are out of the northwest at 14 miles per hour, creating a wind chill of zero in Aurora and DeKalb. Feels like two below in Kankakee. So let's look at the future. Cast wind chill temperature as we go through the evening. Here's 11:30 at night, one below in DeKalb, zero in Waukegan, and tomorrow morning another cold start for the kids as they head out the door to school and you for your commute. Five below in Aurora and Joliet, and also into Kankakee. During the day we still struggle. Right at noontime, wind chill values or feels like temperature in the single digits. Right now we have 22 degrees, but look how far south this Arctic air has really fallen all the way to the Gulf Coast. 26 degrees right now in Houston, and we do have winter weather alerts out for parts of the deep, deep south. New Orleans, a hard freeze warning, a winter storm warning for Houston because we've had sleet. We've had snow along this Arctic front from Houston to Lake Charles right into the Atlanta area. So on the north end of this, low pressure pulling away is generating that northwest wind over northwest Indiana, creating the lake enhancement. So we do have winter weather advisories to tell you about and a new storm report coming in. The Valparaiso snow total now up to five inches of new snow this afternoon. From this lake enhancement, you can see it here from Westchester right through Chesterton. Valparaiso is really confined to Porter County. For now, it's going to be swinging into Laporte. But for now, it looks like Lake County finally starting to see some improvements. But visibility to Valparaiso is one mile right now. And that lake enhancement is going to start inching away by mid night. It should be out of the picture. And then as we get into tomorrow morning, everything drying out nicely. So our low temperature tonight will bottom out at seven, but it may feel like five below. And then tomorrow cold, but sunny. Everybody can enjoy a sunny day, even Northwest Indiana, 21 degrees. We are climbing the temperature as we close out the week. Look at that Friday near 40 in some spots. So three dry days with warmer temperatures each day. And our next storm Robin Erica is going to be rain middle and upper 40s and some 50s. All right, Mary Kay, thanks. Cold and snow covered out there, but Mary Kay says get ready for a warm up. Yes, Mary Kay, at least you have that good news for us down the line, right? Right, but those winds, you saw them there with the flags, they're really starting to kick up out there, creating some cold wind chills. But now the snow has moved out of Porter County, headed into LaPorte. We have a 13 degree temperature right now from Nancy in LaPorte. She does have snow, but you know, she captured this really cool shot when the snow bands started coming in on that frozen and shoreline of Lake Michigan. So beautiful picture to share with us this evening. And then currently we have dropped to nine above right now in Montgomery from Dick. His skies are clear. And when the sun went down, it was very quiet on the Illinois side this evening. Well, we have Arctic air in place tonight, but as we move through the day tomorrow, it's still cold, but then we start to see a transition to milder air as we reach into the weekend. So here's Saturday and even into Sunday, the mild air stays in place for us. So that means the next system that meets that mild air is going to bring rain showers this weekend. First chance would be at daybreak on Saturday right into Sunday. Currently it feels like 10 below in Aurora, 8 below in Kankakee, 3 below in Rensselaer. So we have to get through this Arctic air mass first. It is 15 degrees in Chicago, only 4 in Kansas City, 21 degrees in Dallas, 26 in Houston. A hard freeze warning for much of the Gulf Coast as this Arctic front now has pushed into the Gulf of Mexico. Look at the snow. 
all the way down to the Gulf Coast. That's because Arctic air keeps wrapping around this area of low pressure, setting up that lake enhancement. You have Arctic air coming over the 35 degree lake, a relatively warmer lake, and that is what's generating those lake enhanced snows. See how they moved out of Porter County and now they're into Laporte. So places like New Durham and Kingsford Heights and Michigan City are really seeing the snow. So we're keeping the winter weather advisory up tonight right into the morning hours. So our forecast calls for feels like temperature below zero. Indiana snow otherwise mostly clear on the Illinois side. We can all see some sunshine tomorrow. 21 degrees for the high temperature. A southwest wind that's going to turn things around and climb that temperature. Three nice bright days Friday near 40. And by the time the next disturbance rolls in, Robin Erica, it's going to be rain because 45 Saturday and almost 50 on Sunday. All right, but we can still look forward to the weekend mm -hmm. with those temperatures. Thank you, Mary Kay.